good afternoon everybody from this um, pretty gray, drizzly, and a little bit windy Boston day. Um, you know, we had a really good day yesterday, uh, and now it's kind of gross outside, but hey, you know what? I'm here on MIT's campus, which is also kind of gross. I'm not the biggest fan of MIT's campus, especially as a BU student, but we're not here for MIT. We're here because Kendall MIT Station has a brand new entrance. So yeah, that's right. Um, Kendall MIT, also known as MIT Cambridge Center, if you're riding on the Bombardier Red Line trains, um, has a new headhouse. This one behind me is the outbound headhouse, which has yet to be redeveloped, um, because this is not technically an MBTA project. Obviously, it is, you know, pertaining to the MBTA, but the reason that the inbound headhouse has been redone is because MIT is redoing a whole chunk of their campus over there. There's the MIT Museum, which is new, MIT Welcome Center, and all that good stuff. And to match in with that, there is a new headhouse. Um, this side is supposed to be redone as well in the near future, um, as long with, along with the redevelopment of this whole building over here. But because this is not associated with MIT, um, it's not being redeveloped at exactly the same time. So. Yeah, not a lot of adjustments being made to the surface. The inside of the station still looks the same, but your first impression is gonna be a whole lot better now when you get on the train at Kendall MIT. And there's a whole new concourse too that we're gonna go check out. All right, and here we are in the new part of the concourse. It's not that big. It's really just enough room for the escalator stairwell, stairwell over there, and a little walkway to the entrance. And you can see that construction over there is actually uh, left over from the temporary headhouse they have, which honestly looks not half bad. They could have kept it, and people probably would have complained, but because it's not modern. But it looks a lot like the Boylston or Park Street headhouses. So not bad at all. Um, and then another thing you see, the T is sticking with their whole thing of redundant elevators, which is great, um, you know, really important. Uh, unfortunately, there are two different buttons, so they're definitely not linked, but hey, it's okay. Uh, and then yeah, you just have this really nice open entryway space that's all new uh, if you're going into downtown from MIT. There you have it, a pretty short video about uh, this new entrance, just because, well, there's not a ton to say, and also because I have a class back on BU's campus in about an hour that I need to make, but I just wanted to tell you about this cool new thing uh, that is being funded by MIT as a part of their transit-oriented development program. I'm sure you can read up more on their website. I'll see if I can find a link and put it in the description, and also say, uh, be on the lookout for when the new outbound headhouse opens up, but for now, that's all for me. I gotta go catch the next alewife train up to Central Square and then get the 47 back to campus. So I'll see you in the next video.